In this video, we'll convert 1.36 moles of SO2 to grams, that's sulfur dioxide, and this 1.36, that's a number I made up for the video. So we have 1.36 moles of SO2, and when we have moles and we want to go to grams, we're going to multiply by the molar mass. And we can find the molar mass for SO2 by going to the periodic table and adding up the masses of all of the atoms here. When we do that, we get 64.07 grams per mole, the units for molar mass, grams per mole. Now we multiply, we have moles on top and the bottom, they cancel out. That leaves us with grams. That's what we're looking for. So we know we set this up right when the units cancel out, leave us the one we're looking for. 1.36 times 64.07, that gives us 87.14 grams of SO2. So to recap, we had moles and we wanted to get to grams. So we multiplied by the molar mass. If we were given grams of SO2 and asked to convert that to moles, we'd just do the opposite. We have our grams, we divide by the molar mass, and that would give us moles. This is Dr. V converting moles of SO2 to grams. Thanks for watching.